hello we're doing part three because Fiddy keeps dying okay so now we're gonna open this up we got a box like I said these were seven eight dollars and I got them on sale for four it's got little stuff in it like a little popsicle I've never had that before <laughs> Lufa, they don't really care for but whatever <laughs> they a little beat or whatever this is I'm um, a little banana and then um little thing that says hamster on it the other one said rabbit and then I have one before that says rat and I can also use this box for them to chew on which I like a little toy chest all right moving on I got this little peanut house I've always seen this peanut house but I've never gotten it and I decided to get it it's made by you and me it's actually like a plasticky feeling but I guess it can be um chewed on and it's safe because I can't give them any plastic I did give them a plastic bowl and they actually like I forgot to take it out and they destroyed it so I got this you and me house it was only a few bucks so it does on sale so I decided to try it next um Next, I got the Puzzle Playground. I've had this before with my gerbil like 10 years ago, and it's a disaster. I hear it's a disaster to set up, but it's going to be good for playtime. I can rinse it out and share it with all the other gerbils. Obviously, it will not be kept in their cage because, like I said, they chew plastic, but I'm interested to try it, and I got it for a really good deal. Next, I got this. It's actually not in the box. I took it out because Luda has it. This is my third time buying this. For, it's like $3, a little bit more maybe. My third time buying it. And um, I have one for the slate, I have one for um, Kedzie, and then now one for Luda. Because I don't like to share them. Because when I share stuff when they play in the bathtub, they end up pooing and peeing in it. It's not good. So I got that. Next, I got the snack shack. Like I said, I have the ladder now. I've had the little log. I have all the little treats. So I figured I'd try it out. You can't really see it, but here's what it looks like. I don't know who I'm going to give it to yet, but um, it's usually really expensive. I got it for a fairly decent price, but I figured I'd like to try it out because... Like I said, they've never had it. That's what it says. Okay. Moving on. I got this little wigwam. I've had this before, but like I said, I'm going to get it again. This is a small size. They have a large. Luda's had it. It's like a little house, and I think it's really cute. Okay. Let's see. Moving on. Sorry, it's so shaky, but... Timothy hate twists. They want like six bucks for these at PetSmart, but I get them online for like $1.99. And it's cool because I can share them and everybody likes them, so that's good. Next, I got the Eco Ecotrician uh, Chew. It kind of reminds me of a cheesy chew. And like I said, they're always really expensive in the store, so I figured I'd try one. I originally had two in my cart, but then I put one back because they're kind of expensive. And it does have an expiration date, so it must be like it's edible. Next, I got two of these in my order. I don't know why. I did not order. I did not pay for it. I got two of these. They were wrapped up really nice. And I'm like, oh, where did I get this wrap? I didn't order a food dish. So I got two of these. I don't know what the heck I'm going to do with it because I don't like it. And the gerbils obviously can't have it. Next, I got these. I got these freaking sweet potato yummies. I already bought these at my last haul at Awesome Nursery. I forgot that I ordered them. But I guess you can never have enough. They usually are real soft, but lately they've been coming kind of hard, so we'll see what happens. Next, I got two packs of these. Um, I got two because there's four cages, and they're just crispy crop, crispy crop of chews critters crave. It's like tongue twisters. It says, what is it? Uh, crispy, a crispy crop of chews critters crave. Say that real fast. Next, alfalfa rolls. I got, like I said... Two rolls of these. Rice pops are their absolute favorites, so I figured, you know, I get these. Alfalfa's not 100% good all the time, but they do like it and they do enjoy it. And then lastly, I got two bags of millet. It's only a couple bucks, a dollar and some change each. And Kenzie loves it, the gerbils love it, and you can really never go wrong with millet. I usually buy the bird millet from PetSmart, I know, from Austin Nursery. It's, it's like four ounces and it's a little bit cheap too but this is uh actually probably i don't know if it's cheaper or not whatever but i have two bags i'm on my other i have a bag right now so we'll be stocked up and that's pretty much it for my petco order i can now add this stuff to their toy chest and then i can use this box for oreo to play with and then i can go play with the gerbils in the bathtub that's all peace out